Greetings ladies and gentlemen, welcome to video 15 of our Ultimate Skyrim Let's Play. Last video, I was just making my way over to the College of Winterhold and I did do just that. But I did do a little bit of housekeeping before getting this uh, video started. First, I got my horse to the college and then I dumped all my gear into the bins in my room. And then I sold off the excess gear to Ungarub. I can't pronounce his name. I think it's Ungarub. I'm probably pronouncing that wrong. And then I did a little bit of training. And then I leveled up a bit. And then I got a new skill. Which was the telekinetic hand as well as... What's this? Absorbing grasp. Ooh, okay. And I also got Absorb Health. So these are my two, I guess, combat abilities, which I'll be using right now. Oh, jeez. I'll be using it right now for the midden clear. Hopefully I can clear it. Left hand, right hand. So we'll be doing that right now. I've never actually used these spells, so I don't know what to expect. Hopefully... It'll be okay. I can actually hear some nonsense in the distance. Now I'm going to close that door. I'm scared. Oh, 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 oh. Level 9 Ice Wraith. Okay. How does this work? I don't... Is, is, is he stuck? Oh, that's quite damaging, actually. Oh. Oh, there we go. Jeez, that was weird. It was like it wasn't really hitting him or connecting. Oh, this is gonna suck. <laughs> I can already see it now. Need to wait. This telekinetic hand's not really working out, though. Not sure how it works. Because kind of hoping I could be like a Jedi, you know, how he picks up things and throws it. Oh, what's that over there? See something in the distance? Oh, it's a frozen man. He looks spooky. I uh, also got rid of my potions, fortunately. <laughs> I do have this fondue though, which I'll eat. How do I how do I do this? I think they should just give you unloaded magicka. Oh, what the hell? It's a girl. Were you here before? Oh my god. That... What's making that noise? Oh my god, it's the girl. That scared me. <laughs> oh, what was that? Oh. Re rebuke. Oh, is it right there? Oh, there it is. Oh, that was really far away. Oh, that's... I need to test this out, I'm sorry. Like, how is this supposed to work? And pick up that large shovel and throw? But does it do damage? That's the thing. If it does damage, then that might be interesting. This has a thing. It's like Half-Life. Hello? Shalom? No. No one there. I feel like I should bring the shovel with me. I feel like throwing a shovel in someone's face might do damage. How about this little girl? Let's test you. You look like a willing participant in my, my studies. No. Nope. You, uh, take damage? Does it say even does damage though? Like I want to see. Oh, 
might just be absorbing hand will do my damage, it seems. But we need to test this out further, I think. Uh oh, there goes my weapon. Bone meal or salt. Ooh, small dagger of sparks. Might as well loot everything. I mean, I do have crates for it now, so I can afford it. Yes, 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 yes. And I can sell it all. Ooh, salt. It salt is good for cooking and other things. And what the hell is that? Oh, it is my campfire. My mistake. Uh oh. Oh, damn it. Oh, no. E. Oh, there it is. There's the little... There you go. Cancel placement. Ah. That's what happens. You don't know what's going on. You do panic and start clicking the buttons. Let's see. More salt. A lot of salt down here, I find. Oh, but the... Are you a person? Yeah, man. I mean... Hey, do you want to do me a favor and test out a theory for me? No? You'd think throwing an object would do some damage. I'm not gonna, like, absorb his health then. Dude, that sucks. That sucks the big one. Damn it, now I can't really use tel telekinetic grasp for anything useful. Take this, though. Take that. This is how I think you become a lich. You have to wait till like the moon is out, I think. I think that's how you do it. That's the meme, at least. Okay. You know, it just kind of dawned on me. Like, why would there be a little girl underneath the college? What were they doing? Long time ago, in ye olde days, you know? What kind of chronic secrets does the college hold, hmm? Why aren't they telling us, hmm? Why aren't, they, why aren't you telling me, College of Winterhold Mages? Can I pick up that hoe? Oh. oh. Who is it? Hello? Oh! Okay, well, he's got a bow and arrow, because of course he does. Let's hide behind here. Uh, mage armor. Wonder how he can do this now. Because my telekinetic or my grasping hand isn't that strong. Or that long range. Or absorb health, I should say. But maybe I can get him from up here. Actually, let's... Mm, mm, uh, mm. I was going to refresh this and make it a dual cast. So we do have time before I engage. He's up over here. Take that torch sconce. Where do you go? I will take this then. As tribute. 
Is he down here? Oh, he is. Okay. Okay, that didn't do anything. I guess because he's already dead. Um, okay, hold on. Ah! Okay. Um, this might be an issue. Okay. And this is why every mage goes destruction, because... <laughs> and we just, like, use the dot to do the damage here. Slowly but surely. Just burst fire, just like that. Eh. There we go. It was getting wise there in the last second. But we'll take your stuff. And I will sell it. Thank you. It's over here. Just hanging out up here. That needs a key. But we'll take these bottles. I think I can make water out of them. I think. Yes, surely I can. Bottle? Yeah, I can make bottles. And then we just went, uh, Fire Mage for the rest of the way through. It's kind of hard to justify playing as, like, any other class, though, because... Well, not really class, what am I saying? Like, um, like, focusing on a different sort of tree? Because it's just, like, nothing here. Because, like, it does, like, no damage. So you're kind of forced, if you're being, like, a full, uh, mage, to be destruction, or at least conjuration... Because the other, like, trees don't really have it. Like, I would say maybe Alteration is more of, like, a secondary tree. Like, after you filled up, say, Conjuration or um, Destruction, then you go into the other sort of areas. Restoration is a little bit unique because it's obviously very effective versus Undead. And the vast majority of Skyrim is nothing but Undead creatures, if we were to be honest. Like, every dungeon has Do- I was gonna say Dodger. I mean, Draugr. So, it's a unique case in that sense. Okay, should I jump down? No, that's bad news. Let's do this slow and steady. Keep an ear out. Oh. Mm. Candlelight. Looks like I'm starting to get cold, or that could be something else. Kind of disappointed about Telekinetic Hand. It's an adept spell. It should be able to do, like, pick up people. I think that happens later on, though. I think maybe Alteration, maybe one of those... It's hard to get started, but once you get going, you're just, like, a Jedi Master. I think that's the meme. You're Jedi Master now, Luke. Oh. Wrong place, not there yet. Gotta go through the quest a bit more. But we can check it out a bit more here. Okay, so I hear skeletals. Okay, so skeletals don't have health to absorb because they're dead already. That makes. Oh. He's coming for dinner. I bet he has a bow and arrow. If they're melee, I can handle it. But if they have a bow, then it's... Well, oh, he's a skeletal. That's stuck. There we go. Let's exploit the AI for all it's worth. There we go, lad. Yeah, there you go. Very good. Oh, he's a wise one. He's smart. Oh, not that smart, though. There you go. Very nice. Almost full, though, on gear. Oh, damn. 
I remember this room. This is the all the skeletons spawn in room. <laughs> Let's not go in there right now. I'll take that loaf of bread though, just in case. Yeah, I don't want to go in there. Or do they spawn in? No? Just the two? Could have sworn like 50 of them spawned in. Um, Drop that. Here, you can have a sword. I'm still overweight. Here, have a hatchet. wood pile. Mm, I should pick up that wood at some point. I never actually completed this quest. Not really sure what it's what it's here for. It looks like awesome though. One of these days I'd like to complete it. It's on the list. Goat pelt. Let's keep on going here. Sacrificial goat. Naturally. Hug the wall. Keep safe. Did I pick up that moss now? Nah. Oh. Mm. I think I can make a little porthole here and then fire out from the spiders. I don't hear any spiders. Oh jeez, there they are. Oh jeez, there they f and are. Just don't come here. Stay away. Can't come through the hole. It's, you're too big. You're too big. I made the hole perfectly sized just for me, but not for you. Yes. Take it. Oh no, I made the hole big. I made it big. Now they're going to come through. So creepy. I'm getting hungry. Not the time for hunger. Oh god, I made it even bigger. Eh, there you go. Shots fired. There you go. Oh yes, good hits. Good hits, burn, burn, burn. I think fire should do extra damage to spiders, you'd think. Because I've seen that arachnophobia movie. We all have. We all know what I'm talking about. are you all this comes down to destruction magic doesn't it at the end of the day quite disappointing where are you where'd you go are you i think he's behind the wall yeah oh, 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 oh. don't come don't follow me you can't come in your AI says no. Oh, maybe not. Maybe his AI says yes. AI says yes. He can come through. See your little shadow. Hmm. I like what uh, Belmont Boy's done with the AI, though. Or uh, I should say the mod maker that um, Belmont Boy... Uh, Included in the game the mod maker that uh, updated the AI for Skyrim. It's a lot smarter Though in some respects it shouldn't be this smart. I mean, it's like a spider. It should kind of just come after me It's like very tactical It's like a commando spider like it just knows See look at him look at him look at him. He knows hiding in the little corners here I know where you are come out come out I have unlimited magicka here. Set fire to things. Burr. Oh, maybe... 
Oh god, I didn't know there was a door there. Oh <laughs> jeez. Like, this is probably the best spot, because I don't want to get poisoned, you know? Because all it takes is one shot, and that'll probably bring me down to near no HP. And by no HP, I mean I'll probably die. Where do you go? I hear skeetering. Hello? I hear the pitter-patter of little feet. Oh god, I'm in his territory now. Could pop out from any corner. Back to the wall. Shields up. Hello? Hello, bang, bang, bang. Dinner. Dinner served. Oh, there he is. Oh, smart lad. Using the corridor to his advantage. Ooh. Damn it. I don't know what I was planning to do there. <laughs> There we go. Victory. Oh, honeycomb. Yes, I'll take those. I think those are pretty good. My own grandpa. What the hell is this? Sounds gross. Something about that title of my own grandpa sounds gross, but I'll pick it up. I'll pick it up and have a read. Another kettle. Let's put you back where I found you. In the trash where you belong. Oh. Um. Suppose I can just extract venom. Oh, very good. That's also pretty good because I can also... I do have a crossbow, and I could lace the shots with poison, so that's always good as well. And harvest ingredients here. Thermal bone. Can also butcher the meat. Raw spider meat. I didn't even know that was a thing. Search. Nothing in here. Dispose. Wonder what this would cook. Raw spider meat. Ugh. Gross. I could sell that. Look at that. Look, at that. It's got little rotten dots in it, like it's bubbling. Bro, somebody actually textured this. I'm gonna drop you on the ground. Oh, damn. Leave you there for now. The garbage. Oh, that's scaring. Okay. That's fine. Um, I think I've cleared it out then, pretty much. I think there's only um, a chest around here, up here, I think. I don't think I can open it, though. Oh, no, I can get up here. Watch, watch, watch. No, I can get up here. Watch, watch, watch. There you go. Eh, eh. There you go. There's the chest. Oh, it is unlocked. Perfect. I'll just take that money then, and I'll take this helmet. Okay, I won't take this helmet. I'll drop the helmet, and I'll come back for it later. Why did I go back down? That was dumb of me. Uh, come on. Don't worry, I can get up here. Watch, watch, watch. There you go. Okay. Uh-oh. Not enough stamina to do the jump. Okay. Never mind, I can still keep on jumping while I have no stamina. I didn't know that. <sighs> Failure. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, you know what? I think I am going to pause the footage here. And when we get back, more Ultimate Skyrim coming at you. Going to speed through the process as quickly as possible so we can get that tutorial out for you guys. So with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to thank you all for watching. And if you like videos like these and want to see other videos like them, be sure to like and subscribe. If not, I understand. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.